It's lunchtime. I'm hungry. We got to get something to eat. Let's do something healthy. Something healthy. I'm around for it. Why not? What's going on, y'all? It's Claude. You're checking me out again at Mostly Healthy Food Reviews. Today, I'm in Milford, Connecticut. I decided, or well, we decided, well, she decided. This is my friend, Sager. She wanted something healthy. We're going to try something healthy. I'm here at the Bella Subs. Actually got some real good flavors and some fire for us right now. We're going to take a step inside, see what's going on, get some food. Y'all know the routine, man. Let's get right to it.
guy finished eating. We're at the Bellas, Milford, Connecticut, Post Road. And y'all know me. I'm still talking with my hands. Stop judging me. I got my co-host with me today, my friend Tasia. And what did you think about the Bellas? Um, it was really, really good. I had the Godfather. It was spicy ham, capicola, and salami. I like the Italian style sandwiches. Those are my favorite. And um, I put spicy man, um, spicy mayo, spicy mustard, mayonnaise. They have a, a oil dressing that I put on it also with uh, banana peppers, lettuce, and it was on an everything bread. That bread was the best. It was amazing. I ate my whole sandwich and somebody judged me, but I definitely recommend this place. This woman sitting next to me is such a little person by stature. If y'all know who she is, if y'all know, she's tiny. So for her to be able to inhale that whole sandwich the way she did, she took it like a champ. We got six inch sandwiches. Um, first one I had, um, showed y'all on camera, was the uh, chicken stir fry or chicken cheesesteak. Chicken cheesesteak. Chicken Philly cheesesteak. Chicken Philly cheesesteak. Mushrooms, onions, peppers, sauteed. Um, I didn't put any dressing on it, and the reason being is I wanted to taste the sandwich without anything. No condiments, no mayo, no nothing. I usually get a little light mayo on mine or whatever. Y'all know how I do. But this one, honestly, it was a banger. It was. Start to finish, as soon as we walked into Bella's, we're, we're smelling bread, the fresh bread. You don't get that at a Subway. You don't get that nowhere, truthfully. And I'm not sitting there throwing shots at y'all. Subway. All I'm saying is that <laughs> you just don't we get that. Shots. So, yeah, shots fired, I guess, at this yeah. point. We throwing shots. Y'all got to come hard. <laughs> Y'all got to come hard. Y'all know it's going to be a real review. The second one I got was a veggie sub. Um, veggies, lettuce, tomato. Um, they did um, jalapenos. I had banana peppers, onions, um, you know... It was a good sandwich. It was it was flavorful. Both my sandwiches had Swiss cheese on them. I tried to eat something healthy today to try to balance out what I was doing as far as the chicken. And y'all saw the pull on that cheese. I know you saw the pull on that cheese. And I promise you, it was everything that it was just now in the pull on that cheese. And I put pepper jack cheese on mine. It made it a little bit, for those of you that like spice, on top of the spicy ham. That was like the best part. She gets it popping. I promise you. She gets it popping. Chase, what are you going to give your sandwich as far as a rating? They get a five. I love <laughs> you my a five? sandwich. Oh! And my everything bread okay. was everything. No. It was amazing. That's dope. That's dope. I've had veggie subs before in my life. I'm going to go ahead and give that a three and a half. Going to three and a half is just veggies. The bread is really good. And honestly, at the Bella's, the bread is what makes the sandwiches, in my opinion. Very, very fresh ingredients. You don't have any issues. And honestly, I got to give a shout out to the staff, man. Yes. They were really, really good today. And before I give my final review on the chicken cheesesteak, I, I just want to thank them for being really hospitable with us and being patient yeah. because we were in there trying to throw sandwiches together and do our one two thing. Yo, she even got a cookie, man. I did. Who gets cookies? I did. I did. Oh, it's right here next to me. I got a cookie. I'm going to devour this when I get home. I can't eat it in the car because somebody is allergic to nuts. But... This cookie's going down. That's the greed. That's the greed in some yes. people. So anyway, <laughs> <laughs> my final review for the chicken cheesesteak. You know what? That's what I'm going with. I'm going with a five, y'all. This was a banger.
definitely a banger. Would I recommend it? I most definitely will. Would I come back and get it? Most definitely would. The Bellas, you guys got a fan, man. This is a, this is a good spot. I had no idea, and I actually passed by here, and we were just talking about this. Mm -hmm. I passed by here like a million times going shopping and going to different places on the Post Road here in Connecticut and Milford. And they've been here for a while. Ever. And the funny part is, when you look at their parking lot, they're always got something going on. Even in the middle of a pandemic right now, they got a bunch of cars out here. So if y'all guys have never been to the Bellas, you need to come out here and, and, and give them a shot. Because honestly, I'm really glad that we did today. I want to give a special shout out to my friend, Tasia, over here. She stuck with me hey. through all my madness. See, it wasn't that bad, was it? No, it was fun. See, it was easy. See, was I'm, I'm easy. It's what it is. It's easy. Um, yeah, so before I forget, Sage, let them know where they can find you on social media. My IG is Exquisite Beauty, X Q U I S I T B E A U T Y. Um, hit her up, say what's up, let her know that you stopped by, let her know that you've been on the channel, saw the video, and that's what it is, man. In any case, this is Claude, mostly healthy food reviews YouTube, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram. I'm around for all the good food and flavors, and if it's actually a good food. And it's a good flavor, and I got good company with me. I'm good. That's really what it is, man. Y'all be cool. I'll talk to y'all next time.